Hello, welcome back for another watch review. Today we're looking at a couple of Tagoya Aqua Racers. Uh, reference number, we have the black one here, black dial and black bezel. It's a Way 201A and then we have the 201B, assumably for blue. Uh, both on bracelet. Uh, these are essentially the same watch with just a different colour dial and bezel. Um, let's have a quick look round. We'll start with the black one. As you can see, the dial, you have a wave effect. I don't know what you want to call it there. Uh, and a cyclops for a date there just to make it magnifying when you are looking at it. They both have the Caliper 5 automatic movement. So that gives you 38 power reserve from a Swiss movement. Um, sweeping second hand. You have polished edge there, brushed on the top. The bracelet is brushed. Screw down crown, screw down case back. These are divers watches with the 300 meter water resistance. Um, your bezel here is ceramic, so that will not scratch. Uh, well, you take a lot of force for it to scratch. Um, but what you will find is the still surround may still get scratched and banged and take up a few dents. They can be replaced, they're not that cheap to replace, but not overly expensive either. Bracelet, wonderful bracelet. Uh, you have a push button class to release and then you also have the diver's extension here. If you're putting on a wetsuit, probably does not get used on 99.9% .9 of these watches. If I move over to the blue dial, that's are exactly the same. You're just getting a blue dial and a blue bezel. Bezel movement on these, quite nice. Um, not the best in the market, but again, at this price range, you are getting a lot of watch for the money. And I do think these are great tool watches uh, for the price. And again, very, uh, legible both during the day and during the night with all the loom. Okay guys, uh, please like and subscribe and as always any comments are welcome.